Charles here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. You guys, for today's video, I am so beyond excited because this is a collab that I've wanted to do for a very, very long time. Today we are joined with oh Mr. Kate. We have Sister Kate and Daddy Joey over here and you guys. <gasps> Daddy Joey, yes, oh my God. Daddy. I'll take it. Okay, good. We are together today because we are doing a collab that is not makeup related for once. It is house related because as all you sisters know, I recently bought a house a few months prior and I moved in. I've been here for quite a while now and by the time this video is going up, it is I believe January. Yes. Maybe. Yes. That means I've been in the house for about four months now mm -hmm. and that means that you guys still have not gotten a house tour. <laughs> He's been busy, okay? <laughs> Palette, merch, traveling the world. A, a little bit, <laughs> yes. As soon as I bought this house, Kate was like, we need to do something and I was like, oh absolutely because I've been subscribed to Kate and Joey for literally years now, for the longest time ever. I stand you guys, I think you guys have have one of seriously the <laughs> coolest channels on YouTube. I've been there since like before even like 300,000. Like the longest wow. time, sort of God, the oh longest God. time. Like I said, as soon as we moved in, Kate hit me up and was like, we want to do a makeover. And I was like, please, I need help. But <laughs> yeah. I want to do something for my channel too because like I said, this club I've wanted to do for a very, very long time now. Oh no, so, and he's so passionate about interior design, which is so cool. Yes, <laughs> so for today's video, we're doing something that Kate and Joey have never done before actually. And I am so beyond excited because we are obviously going to do the full room transformation over on Kate's channel. We'll talk about that in a little bit when we're going through the house and you yeah. guys can see that video yeah. over there. Go yeah. subscribe, please. <laughs> but over here, because of the fact that so many of the rooms are in the process, mm -hmm. not done, but also not the worst. No. We figured it'd be- Started. Yes. Sister started. Sister <laughs> <laughs> we figured obviously we want to let Kate shine and do her makeover, but for my channel, we want to do a more collaborative type mm -hmm. thing and work together to finish yeah. a lot of the rooms that I've started and yeah. kind of show you guys what the process looks like of actually taking your room and doing it from start to finish. So this might be a little bit of a longer video, but I'm so excited to just take you guys through. This is going to be a full production. HDTV is shaking. <laughs> Mr. Kate and James Charles are coming for you guys. So without further ado, let's walk through the house, show you guys what we have going on, show you what we want to do, and let's decorate together. All right, sisters, so we're here at the front door and we thought we'd do a little bit of a walkthrough through the house to show you guys what is done, what isn't done, and what we really need to work on for this little yeah. house makeover. Gonna be really honest with you guys, um, we already filmed this entire thing a month ago and the footage is nowhere to be found. <laughs> but would it be a James Charles video without a technical difficulty? No. So we're gonna redo it today. <laughs> redo it, we've already rehearsed. It's yes. gonna be way faster. Kate, Kate's a month more pregnant. I'm a, yep, <laughs> bigger belly. Thank you, disclosure. And now that we've had over a month to think about each space and order some stuff as well, yeah. we thought we'd walk you guys through it again, but this time kind of talk about our thought process as to why we chose each thing and what the room is going to be. The as plan. opposed to like our initial first reaction. So this yeah. is like, a review instead of a first impression. It'll like, be better. Oh, so without further ado, let's walk through the house. Let's do it. Again. Again. <laughs> so room number one is my PR package room. <laughs> <laughs> this is like the big, like it's really your this, entry room. It is. Way. And this is the most boxes we've ever had. We did film this already and spoiler alert, we've already ordered a majority of the things for this house makeover. And they arrived. And they arrived. Thank Clearly. You. So we'll actually be able to execute this. Yes, but for right now, we're keeping all the boxes in this room because this particular entrance foyer living room space living room is room. not going to be in my video because <gasps> we're going to be doing it for an OMG We're Coming Over episode on our channel. All the boxes are being stored in here for every other makeover. Mm -hmm. So let's just move on to the next room. The dining room is probably the most unused room in the entire house. Really? <laughs> well, yeah, I don't really eat. Yeah, you don't here. eat. Oh, right. You don't eat them for dining, but people no, sit but here. No, but does anybody. True. Does anybody really eat in their dining room though? <sighs> Depends. If you have another eating room, which you do. Which I do, in the kitchen. Yeah. Well, we're going to style them so that this doesn't become an area where crap gets collected like it is right now. I mean, Drag me! Oh my god! <laughs> I want this to like feel like a full dining room. So, let's talk about what we need in this room. First of all, lighting. This light is literally the ugliest thing I've ever seen in the entire world. I want it gone immediately. Yeah, it's like very spider. It's spider-esque. Gross. Yeah. And I feel like these like 
Sponsor, Sponsor. Also really tacky as well. Right, which you specifically didn't like the kind of like plasticky look to the shades. It looks like those cups <laughs> that you like go to your grandma's house when you were younger and she would like serve you drinks and those. Do you know what I'm talking about? Like the weird, like, right. Yes, yes they're like those. the hard plastic yes, cups. Yes, those yes, exact I know, cups. the fancier yes, ones. So yeah. like, those just aren't it. We talked about anchoring this table with a rug because yes. you have the dining table is very much kind of feels connected to that other room. Yes. So in order to make sure this really feels like its own space, an yes. area rug is key for I that. Love that too. And as well, the table is wood and the hardwood floors are also wood, which for me, I don't like. Right, so you want to separate it. It'll be separated, it. yeah. which is really, really nice. And, and you already have like some awesome plants you can work with. Yeah. You ordered some more like planters and stuff. But really this room is pretty straightforward. Like, great, Sister Simple moving on. Yes. Sister Scoot. To the next room. Yeah. So, the next room in the house is our sister office, which needs a little bit of work. I will say we do work kind of all around the house, but I definitely want like a good anchor point mm -hmm. in the home for everybody to just come, just get everything done and just like to really focus it. We talked about you wanted to do the neon sign, right? Just yes. the sister's neon sign. So here. I really want to get a sister's neon sign and this was Kate's idea, but I thought it would just be so just cute and fun and chic just to like light up everything in the mood. We're doing white, of course, duh. Yeah, I that's want... already ordered Yes. on its way. Have, uh, we have some art that we want to hang. We talked about doing floating shelves here just yes. to have additional area for storage, but also some, some display stuff. And we also ordered three stools, which was your idea, yeah. and I love this. So if you want to talk about that a little bit. Sure. Well, I was just saying you have the two chairs in here, yes. but because you want to maybe have some meetings, or you also were talking about how you want to put your calendar on this TV. Yeah. So there was a TV in this room when we first moved in, and I, I live my life by my calendar. Yeah. So I really want to have it displayed on the TV at all times. So I can come in here, check everything, and we can have team meetings and schedule videos and basically everything. I definitely think some subtle changes in this room will really just take it above and beyond and just yeah. be the perfect sister workspace. Great. Love it. Yeah, organization, functionality, no rug. It's less about design. It's more about just like pulling it together. Because yes. it is petite, but yes. a lot has to happen in here. Yes. Okay. Done. Yes. <laughs> yeah, we all All right, so. Yay. Coming into the kitchen and living room, these are probably the spaces that I am most excited about just because this is where I spend like 80% of my time. As do most people, right. right? Living room and kitchen is where everyone gathers. Yes. Okay. I will say out of all the spaces that I've done, this one's obviously not even close to being decorated, but... But you did the most in here. Yes. And I do like how it looks. I mean, you picked the most amazing, comfortable couch. It's it, it gigantic. Like you just, you just draw you over here. The hard part is when you have such a big sectional, right. you want the rug to match the scale of yeah, it. Yeah, and this rug is not the right size. We got a way bigger, like jute, but white yes. jute rug, which will be so nice and homey. It's right off of like your backyard. So it has that kind of almost like beachy feel to it. Right, it's super really cool out there. And then we just talked about getting like some more accessories for these built-in shelves because yeah, so these are amazing. They are. And what happened was I literally packed up all my decor pieces from my old apartment. And whenever we moved in on the first day, I just unpacked them and put them all <laughs> on the shelves randomly to move around later and never move them around. So, <laughs> and people will come and be like, oh my God, your shelves are so cute. I'm like, what? So this definitely needs to be filled way up. And what's cool too is we have a lot of shelf space to work with. So it definitely allows us to get a lot of really amazing decor pieces. Yes. Kate and I are about to go shopping in a little bit actually to get some fun pieces. So you guys will see that in a few minutes. So that's pretty much like the entire shelf region. Yeah. The one thing that I'm really excited about that you actually suggested that I was like a little bit, I was like, when you said it, you were like, oh, I feel like you need a different coffee table. And I was like, excuse me, I love this coffee love this table. Coffee table. But your thought process behind it, I actually really like. So why don't you talk about a little bit about that? Sure, I was just seeing that you have this large scale sofa that creates almost like a square here. So I was seeing a square coffee table seems to be the more organic choice. Yeah. And it'll just be that much more accessible for people sitting on like this right. arm. Because if you're here. It. Right, you can't. <laughs> And he has long arms. I do. I really like this table too. And what's cool is we're actually not getting rid of it. No. We're using it upstairs, which we'll get to in a second. And then you have that amazing picture that you took. Yeah. So, if, there. Jill, if you want to rotate yourself around there, <laughs> we have this huge wall, which is blank and needs to be filled pretty badly. We took a few of the different pictures that I've took on my travels and we blew them up in black and white. We're getting them framed, so I think they'll be so chic on the yeah. walls just to kind of separate everything. Okay, so we're just decorating this room, literally bringing yeah. in the coffee table, the rug, shelf, accessories, 
artwork on the wall, just pull it all together. Just jump off from what you've already started. All right, the sister, what do outside. we call this? Sister outside. <laughs> okay. This needs a lot of work. Working on that, yeah. I feel like this is once again one of those places that with a few minor changes will really make a big yeah. impact. We do have already a TV and a cute fireplace out here, so I feel like just like a little seating moment maybe. And then maybe yeah. just some, some chaise lounge, like lawn chair vibe, like yes. right over there, either like in the grass with a side table in between. Really just something so that you can come out here and actually sit down. And relax, here. yeah. So that's pretty much the outside. Yeah. All done. Next phase, breakfast stuff. Yeah. Kind of tiny, but I feel like it's important considering it's literally what you see when you walk in the front door. Totally, right. You see right down into right it. Right smart And down. then into the backyard. Yeah. Yeah, so so you eat here and also there. Yes. Yeah, This you actually use this table a lot. We do, actually. I just think this space could be a lot more welcoming. This light is literally, it's like, Hideous. <laughs> and, and it looks like it was like a three dollar lamp from like Walmart. We have another chair somewhere in the house, I think. That'll be brought back down. Okay. <laughs> so and then I think same thing here, just to set a piece on the table. To right. Put it together. We also talked about doing just like another piece of artwork there to just yes. mirror image, and then curtains here too, just to bring in a textile. Yes. The majority of the windows you have shades, and you also have like yes. a lot going on that curtains don't make sense, but here they make sense. You can see how they would frame this really frame, nicely. Uh, yes, that's yeah. what I was going to say. I think it'll just make <laughs> it feel a lot more like comfy cozy, Yeah, which will be good because the space definitely needs it. Great. Kitchen. So that's only the breakfast nook. So easy. Kitchen. Next. <laughs> I don't think there's a lot to be done in here, which is great because I feel like a kitchen is a place where you don't really decorate that much. Well, I mean, you have a beautiful kitchen with the finishes and everything, so you don't have to distract. But yeah, I think a centerpiece there, yes. something, which maybe we can pick out like a collection of beautiful tall like vases, just even like white ceramic yeah. or something, so pretty. So that is pretty much the kitchen as well, super yeah. simple. Now we just have upstairs, right? Should we head up? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. this because the two of my favorite rooms in the entire house are up here. My master and the sister studio. So Oh my god. I am you good? Sister winded. Wait, what can we do? <laughs> <laughs> yes, so this landing is great because it's wide, it's epic, you've got your bedroom up here, you've yes. got your beauty room over there. This wall is my least favorite wall in the entire house. I think these built-ins are so ugly and I I just don't, like why? We talked about just doing pillows here. Yes. On the benches. And once again, over to the downstairs, there's just lots of cell space that we should fill up with some cool pieces just to yeah. make it be a little bit more put together. We can't get rid of it, so might as well make it look really great while it's here. Yeah. Okay, so this wall is currently blank right now, and that is because what was here is currently being customized. Mm -hmm. So, you guys know as YouTubers, when we hit certain milestones, we always get our little plaque, which is yeah. always super, super really exciting, exciting and a really amazing thing to work towards. So, yeah. I have my one million plaque standing right here, but I just got my 10 million plaque, which oh is so God, such a milestone. That's so, crazy. Oh, it's been so exciting. So cool. And obviously, that took a lot of time and a lot of hard work, and I want to display it in a really cool way. But it was a really cool idea that you had because the plaque comes as like, it's just more of a trophy right. kind of thing, right? It's like that big play button. Yeah. It's not framed like the one million plaque. Right. So. But this designer right here was like, let's frame let's it. Let's frame it. So <laughs> I really like how the one million plaque was displayed with like the gold play button inside of like the big shadow box. Mm -hmm. So I took both the one million and the 10 million to a custom framer here in California, and we are getting them both reframed because even though I like the one million one, I didn't really like the gray background, kind of ugly. I don't think so, you're customizing your own Oh, black. So we're literally gonna <laughs> cut it open. Take Sorry, the, YouTube. It's being redesigned. <laughs> Cutting it open, taking the 1 million out, and we're also getting the 10 million huge diamond play button custom frame. So they'll be in matching frames, and they'll be the 1 million mm -hmm. and the 10 million right here, Love exactly it. matching, looking beautiful and fun and fresh and chic. And I think it'll be a really amazing way just to look back at all the achievements right before you come into the sister studio. Which brings us to our next one in the house, the sister studio. Sister studio. Oh my gosh, the, this room is so important. So, it's 
crazy. <laughs> so this, the sister studio is probably honestly my favorite room of the entire house. I love equipment and videography and lighting and just trying to see like how can I really elevate myself and make my content that much better. Yeah. So for me, this studio has been like a dream project of mine forever just to really have like the best production space humanly possible to make my content the best for all of my sisters watching. Totally. As you can see, there's like a full-on metal cage that we built in which is this room. Rad. Which is yeah. so cool, and basically that's where all the equipment hangs from, which is amazing because it takes everything off of the floor, yeah. which makes decorating way better. It makes it just feel like a lot bigger because this room was very, very crammed at first. Yeah, I mean, like, you host people like Kim Kardashian in this room. Yeah. So you want to just, like, have it be a little bit more of, like, a studio feel. Right. So, like, this table in particular. Has to go. We talked a lot about this table. This, this table has been the source of so much stress about this makeup. Our most emails back and forth. Literally. Yeah. This table has been, so, for me, this table is literally from Ikea. I got this when I first moved here, and it was great at first. Yeah. But my videos are just getting bigger and bigger production-wise. Mm -hmm. And by the end of my videos, this entire table will be, like, literally, if I pick anything up, everything else will fall off. Absolutely. Like, it's bad. So, yeah. a bigger table to work on and to not feel so cluttered. It's gonna be great for your thing. brain. Yes. Yeah. So we found that table. We found the table. God bless. <laughs> Thank God. Yes. We really wanted a seating area on this end because like I said, we do have a lot of bigger collabs. And if I'm bringing a celebrity client, sometimes they'll bring their team or their manager over, or even if it's like bigger collabs and only one person's on the screen, friends will be chilling here. Right. You know, all the time I'm filming alone and my manager and my assistant and my writer will all be here watching as well. Right. So I just want like a comfortable space for everybody to just once again, have it feel like an actual studio. Okay, so we were gonna do like a little couch, like a little, almost like a bench with a back on it. Yeah, for the And then time. you texted me around Christmas time. Yeah. We met before Christmas, you were like, okay, this is the plan. And you were like, okay, Ethan got me a custom bench. Which is literally so, so cool and yeah. so sweet. Uh, if you guys saw my collab with Dolan Twins and Emma, the Sister Squad, for our Christmas video, yeah. Ethan got me a custom Sisters bench, which I think is so incredibly cute. And he literally got it for me because of the fact that we filmed so many collabs together, where our butts are like really <laughs> broken by the end of it, and we can. And you all have anywhere. very small butts. I mean, well, not I mean thick, <laughs> thick, okay. thick, thick butts, but not long. Well, anyways, <laughs> you all have. Lovely thick butts, and we need a thick bench. You have to sit there so you don't like literally break our backs by the time we're done filming. But we thought since it's usually just me filming, we could really easily use Ethan's sister bench and put it against this wall and decorate it with pillows so therefore everyone's really comfortable. And then that way, too, you can also see the custom sisters on exactly. the front. Exactly. And the beautiful, to a, lit up. Because that's like lit up, right? Yeah, it's full LED. Yeah, it you can be plug so it cool. in. Yeah. And then, of course, if we have a bigger cloud, we can just move the bench quickly over to there so everyone Swap can sit down comfortably. Yep, I love that. So this is the wall. When you walk in the door to the sister studios, you this see this you wall. Kate had a really cool idea. Well, we were just talking about doing like a custom sign. You wanted to do sister studio. So you did like kind of like a splatter paint yes. thing with sister studios, and then we're having it custom custom made on acrylic with then a standoff of the sister studio so it's gonna be black and white of course, of course. keeping with the aesthetic uh, but then you'll walk in and you'll see this big giant sister studio to go to the, the last and final where all the magic happens mm, not a lot of magic happening let's be real <laughs> we're, working we're, we're working on that once we figure out that room there's gonna be lots of magic <laughs> some pasta <laughs> yes the last of the <laughs> The last bedroom I am very, very excited for because this is like the space that I'm in. This is your sister's suite? Yes. <laughs> so I feel like this needs to be like a really just amazing space for me to kind of unwind mm -hmm. at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. So we already have a few decor pieces in here when we got started. Spoiler alert, if you'll notice, um, I have no bed right now. <laughs> because, because Joey took it. Yeah, Joey stole my bed. <laughs> so as soon as we walked in here, Joey noticed. So your bed was a little small, right? Yes. It was a four post bed. Four poster? Four post. Four, four poster. poster. Four poster bed. And because your ceiling goes at an incline, it just it looks a little short. So we're gonna keep it platform, but I'm basically just gonna rebuild all of the posts and make it that much taller so that it looks that much more grand. But keep wow. it in the platform style, which is like the style that you like. Right, kind of for that, sure. Like, lower, more minimal vibe. Okay, so what we talked about in here is obviously just really completing the space because yeah. you have your bed, 
that's being augmented, but this side of the room is pretty much good. Yes. But this side of the room is totally empty aside from this ottoman right. space here. <laughs> right. This wants to be a living room. Like so in hard. order to make it a suite, yeah. you have like a living space attached to your sleeping space. Right. It's gonna be so elegant right. and cozy. So Kate had the really big idea of putting a full on like third living room of the house with a sofa and two chairs, which I think is gonna be so cute. So cute. We picked out literally the best stuff ever, and CB2 is literally downstairs, right now <laughs> delivering everything. <laughs> Hashtag not sponsored, but please. But it should be. It should be. <laughs> I think that'll just make the master bedroom feel a lot more, like you said, like an actual suite that mm -hmm. I can like relax and chill in. In summary, we're building you a bigger bed. We are having this be a modular piece either here or there. We're creating a living space anchored with a rug. We're bringing the coffee table from downstairs up here. And we're styling the shelves and just making it a sister suite. Is that our finished house tour? I think so. Are we done? Are we done? <gasps> it's time to shop. James! <laughs> All right, you guys, so we just arrived at Home Goods and we are gonna be basically decor shopping all, all day today. All the accessories. Thankfully, we ordered all the large items online, which is great, because we don't have to try to cram them in your Tesla. Right. <laughs> They're being delivered. They're being delivered, thank God. <laughs> so we are here for all those accessories, the shelf items, the tabletop items, tray yes. centerpieces, faux plants galore. Like, we're just gonna fill it up because you can always return. So yep. I always say, buy more than you need. More is better. Yeah, we'll see what we can get here and if we need to go to another store, but like, we have lots of options. We have yeah. all day. Yeah. Perfect. Totally your aesthetic. <laughs> oh, you're fired. This one for like your master? Because you have like the she. smaller ones, right? True, yeah. I feel like this is actually really good. <gasps> Cute. I love it. Like a little topiary. It's super yes. simple and minimalistic. I mean, I love crystals. <laughs> what is that smear? These pieces are very questionable. <laughs> Okay, so we were talking about doing like a gathering of taller vases, like maybe on the kitchen yeah. island. You or have somewhere. like like centerpiece situation potential for the dining table. Do you like this? I love that. I love like also mixing it with like like there's this other textured one up there. Maybe it looks like octopus tentacles. Got it. No octopus. Okay. Um, what about this one? Oh, I like that. Right. Pretty. Mm -hmm. That'll be pretty, and it has like a little bit more of the natural tone mm -hmm. coming through. So like, look. Sisters, not twins. Right, yes. love that. Too thick? Mm, we do love a thick sister. We do love a thick sister. That could be good, actually. Yeah, cute. Okay. Oh, I was saying this is like your aesthetic on the globe. Yeah. Right? Do you like the smaller <laughs> one better? Because I'm not the biggest fan of the gold. Okay, well, actually, smaller one's probably good because... It'll fit on the shelf. Ooh, love that. Perfect. And Geometric. Oh. I think that's their display. <laughs> well, you can take it. What are they going to do about it? Yeah, let's be like, put a price on it. We'll take it. <laughs> An hourglass? Ew, that sand is disgusting. Okay, rude. What about this? This is a chic patu gold, no? A what? It's too gold for you? Oh, I thought you said a patu gold. <laughs> I can just make up words. This is a patu gold. I actually don't mind it. Right? I don't mind it either. And like, I just love, love, love the shape of it. Where Very would you much. Put in there? Could be anywhere. It depends on where you put it. Entryway, keys, whatever. On the coffee table, remotes. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'll trust you on the gold. Great. Oh my god, is this a freaking silver That's slinky? That's what I've had in my hand. And do we like it? It's kind of cool. I love it. Kind of fun, right? It's a silver slinky, yes. Wait, this was like before your time, though. You were born after the I know what a slinky it. is. You watch your attitude. <laughs> I am not that young. Do you like crystals? Because you know I love crystals. Do you like a I white? I do. That's I love how a good pretty. white crystal. Yes. Did you grab one of these? Ew. Two hammers. Mm. <laughs> Hammer. I love that. <laughs> oh, wait. There's a sleeker one underneath it. Do you like that? For like down like the dining room table potentially. Or even like under the vases. On your <laughs> long weird shelves under your TV in the family room. Not weird. Glorious. They are a little strange. Right? Oh, that could be good. You know, because then, because even just having something reflective under something else is nice. It just kind of amplifies. Okay. And to finish it all off. Oh, a burlap elephant. Totally your aesthetic. What is this? I picked it up. I don't think it'll really fit anywhere, but it is kind of chic. I like it. Could it could be on the coffee table piece though. Yeah, or like on the, do you have a mantle in your bedroom or no? You're, you don't have an actual no. mantle. But you do have like a counter ledge. Oh, on the side. Yes, we do. Yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, love that. Yeah, a nice like more aged patina to go with that. Cause that is, 
Patina. I'll, I'll put two gold. <laughs> No, but a patina. Patina's a real word. Patina is a real word. I'll put two gold in a patina. <laughs> I like that a lot, actually. Love that. Okay. Let's grab that. Ew. Yeah, it's a little gross. This is kind of chic. Yeah, I love that. That's very up the farmhouse, like, vibes in your house. I really like this a lot. Yeah, I love that. Put a beefy candle in here. I found the, the perfect one. Oh, Joey no. Won. Joey. Oh my god. Tea. Tea? I'm so scared that these are even jokes. What about like just like a simple frame oh, with a mat? God. Because this on its side I think would fit within one of the shelves. Wait, where's our other cart? Oh, great. James! <laughs> This is create. That's kind of cute. That is cute. Should I love how that? simple that is. Look at this too. This Great. is such a chic little pencil holder. Is yes. that an angle? That's so Let's grab your this vibe. Too. Like, look at these together. Oh my gosh. So good. Coming together. Oh my gosh. I love this. This is so fun. Just left the doctor. Let me know what you think. <laughs> like, what about up on the desk? I don't know if it would fit anywhere. Let's get it. <laughs> Great. <laughs> All right, here's what we got so far. You can see James's aesthetic is apparent in a shopping cart, face tuning in the aisle. <laughs> well, I know, we're in a long line. Do it. All right, the load in. Let's see how much this Tesla can handle. Probably a lot. Uh, probably a lot, it's an SUV. How many pieces do we end up picking up? 45, I think she said? Yep, 45 items. So we're definitely on a good, to decor. Yeah, I think that let's stop by Target really quick and grab just some other like throw blankets and other doodads and we're good. Yeah. We're going to Target. We're going to Target. Oh, go. <laughs> All right, so we just loaded the car. We loaded our bellies. I was going to say that. Oh my oh. God. Love that frost. <laughs> I do love that frost. And we have Drew joining us too at Target. He's in a separate car, but we're heading over to Target to get more bits and bobs. Yep. And items Throw and objects. Like trays. Yes. See you there. Decor. So, we want some more office supplies. We didn't find that much. Yes. We want throw blankets, and then let's just get some more Everything. bits and bobs. Bits and bobs! <laughs> oh, yeah. Good pillow. So cute. Good pillow. I think I should be able to pick one thing from every store for you. I think this is totally your aesthetic. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> That's disgusting. One minute in. That child needs to stop screaming immediately. <laughs> <laughs> what about just a simple bookend? Okay. This is much better than the other one. No, but it's it's not. That one looks cheap. Oh! <laughs> no, I like that one. But you can have two. Remember how many shelves sure. we have. I think you probably need this. For what? <laughs> to put options in. Oh, yes! That's kind of cute. Yeah. No, I like that. A simple tray. You questioned and then you like Yeah, see, yeah. good, good, good. Great. I like yeah, these. yeah, love that. Oh, oh, I love that. that. Love the mat because we got some shiny finished oh, ones at Home Goods, so those are beautiful mixed in. Oh my god, look at how chic these planters are! Love that's the best planter I ever did see. Oh, perfect. I'll be needing this. Yeah, oh my god, look at those baskets, those cork baskets are so good. <gasps> Ooh. Wow, that's the best purchase ever. Oh, the cart got closer <laughs> than I was expecting. Can she buy it? Yeah. Oh, wait. oh my god, you said that about the fake plant and the baby just kicked me in my belly, so. <laughs> he approves of the fake plant as well. I like this a lot. Leaning in like the family room. <laughs> like or when you're having a, sa a sister Santa moment. You want to just mount yeah. your <laughs> mantle. I love mounting my mantle. Okay, great. I think that's good. I love it. Do you want a, a rolling pin? Definitely. <laughs> oh, I love those. The felt. That's such a good item. That's cute. That's even cuter. Okay, so we're about to check out right now from Target, but I first want to pause because look at how good. Go, go pull back. Look at how good these cards <laughs> look together. Look, these cards look so. So cheap. good. I, this like, is my favorite thing when you start seeing the room come together like yes. in a shopping cart. Look at how good everything looks. Like, are you yes. literally kidding? And we have all the textures. We have like the soft, we've got the plants, we've got like the wood elements. 
This literally looks the best in the entire world. Like, are you kidding me? I know. I'm so well, okay, we're really talented. Oh, full car. Get but in there's dirty. still room for us. That was a lot. <laughs> I'm Mr. K. I'm here. I'll take a look at your place. We'll stop by for a while and help you find your style. We'll have a famous day. I love you! <laughs> Kay, okay, I told you I'm ready for your, you to go on maternity leave. Oh, focus. I know. You're already remixing me. I'm scared. You are coming for me. I really am. You guys, the new table is literally already here. Which? It's so beautiful. <sighs> Have it's so big and It's gonna be so easy to also clean, thankfully. Wow, this is the most she ever in the entire room, I think. Yep. <laughs> wow, good morning, world. Entire luxury bedroom. Oh, I don't know where I'd go. Maybe I'll sit on my nice luxury couch <laughs> and watch my luxury television <laughs> with my luxury feet on my luxury table. <laughs> Okay, so I don't mind the mirror there, but it would also look amazing right there. Pretty. That's a good background. Yeah. Yeah. So That's good. Really good. That's a good fake plant. Really good fake plant. A fake agave. So cute. So and then and then a taller one over there. Yeah, definitely. And something good. The the bir the bird of paradise maybe right. Should we get that too? Yes. I like this bird's eye. Oh, look at all those balls. <gasps> Decorative balls! <laughs> My favorite! Oh, look at all those balls! I know, look at all those decorative balls! <laughs> decorative balls! You need a good pot for this. Well, you need a good pot. You also need to flare out those a little bit. But you don't want them too flared that they like slap you in the face on your way to go pee pee. Wow. We should put the concrete bowls. <gasps> you want a decorative bowl? Yes! <laughs> I love decorative, I just love decorative bowls. <laughs> I love big round bowls. I yeah, right put, put balls in your room and it'll summon more balls. Ooh, oh, okay. Yes, auspicious. <laughs> let's. Here's your smaller ball. Thank you yeah, so let's much. see what the decorative balls look like next to it. <laughs> decorative bowls? Okay, I don't think this should, this doesn't look good here. This big, the big pot. It's too tall. It's too tall. Okay, ready for this design magic that's about to happen? Um, very, very Sorry, awesome. and you know, I think there should be some target, like maybe. Oh, that was good, James. Is that good? Yeah. Yes! Okay, now that goes here. And then we put a decorative bowl. Right here. What if you do the, the bigger gray one, too? I like that better because it looks more like random. Sometimes you just have to like throw stuff. Hello sisters, we are back at James's house today. James is out at a bunch of meetings today, but we are here to pull more stuff together. We just got this new rug down in the living room. It's Glorious. beautiful. So we have so much to do. We've got signs being delivered today. We've got so many things to hang on the walls. Let's do it. Here we go. So we got this awesome rug in. This is a great rug. The rug that was in here before was too small for the scale of the sofa. So now we've got a rug that actually matches the size of the sofa and the size of the room. Just makes it that much more established. It's also a natural fiber. And then we're gonna get the coffee table, the glass and the concrete coffee table in here, which is gonna be so pretty. Wait, since, since James isn't here, do you think he'll mind if we rug cuddle on his rug? <gasps> the rug is great, is, is, uh, is uh, blessed with <laughs> our love. <laughs> All right, we have this entryway mirror now up right by the front door. Look how beautiful because, hello, James definitely needs a mirror to check his snatched self before he leaves. Update in the office, the shelves have gone up now over the desk, which is going to just make it functional and beautiful over here. We can display things like, oh, I don't know, James's People's Choice Award. Should that be the first thing that goes on the shelf? Oh, it fits. I'm just bringing in some accessories. Of course, I'm gonna like final style with James when he gets back but I'm just kind of bringing in some items that we would style on these office shelves because they're a little bit more utilitarian. And then this amazing lamp, which we couldn't resist. The neon sign's gonna go here. He's gonna have a whole new editing set up here, but the office is coming together. Oh, let's bring in the stool too. Oh. Oh 
my god. Holy crap. <gasps> oh. That <laughs> looks so, so good. good. Oh my gosh, it's in there. That They wow. mounted that beautifully. What, with like glue or yeah, something? I love when we mount YouTube's pox better than YouTube does. Yeah, YouTube takes some cues. <laughs> my picture looks so good there. Let's, let's just pause. Look, well, look, well look three, people, yeah, look, three people are standing here holding. <laughs> No, it does. It looks so good. Really good. Fun. Backstory, we took a picture that I took on my Africa trip, one of my favorite weeks of my entire life, and Kate wanted to frame it for the middle, which I love the idea. Well, yeah, I mean, we, I love the idea of the black and white photography breaking up the text art. Yeah, yeah that's chic. That's, that that's looks good best. and fresh. Yeah, I think I that, like that makes the most sense. And look, we're ending then right there. Right at the end, at of, the the end of the beam. Uh huh. Perfect. Joey right now is standing in the sister studio where I film all my videos all day long, every single day, and like me and Kate were talking about, we needed to add a few extra fun things to make it feel like a full production space. Legit. So Sign. Yes. You want to see it? Yeah, I want to see it. A custom sign of James' design. I did. Yeah. I haven't seen it though. I know. I want to see it. This is a, this is a real for Oh my god, that looks so good. <laughs> it looks oh so good. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I'm obsessed with these flatters. That little turn around. <laughs> Studio selfies in that, we like, and whenever you have, tradition. whenever you have guests come over and you have them take oh, a selfie in front of that. Oh yeah. On the acrylic and it trays too. Like, wow, that's so dope. Good job, team. Yay, team! <laughs> Hello, sisters. It is late afternoon because this morning. Kate and Joey did their reveal to me for their room, and spoiler alert, it looks absolutely amazing. You guys have to check that out on their channel, but- I'm glad you like it. It looks literally the best. <laughs> but now their crew is on the way out, and we have the house to ourselves again. First time in a while. Yeah. And obviously, we have an entire rest of the house to decorate, so- But the fun stuff. But now it's the fun stuff. So, we have all these decor bits and bobs in front of us that we picked out at Target and CB2 and all the places that you guys saw us at Sister Shopping at. <laughs> so we figured we would like show you guys how we want to style the shelves. The entire house. At the store, I feel like we have like 873 items in our car approximately. Yeah. And now looking at the table, we have like 12. Like so we're slightly nine. concerned. We also brought some things up to the landing already. Yeah, we brought some stuff up there already. We have the boxes to fill in space. We were going to get some coffee table books, but that sort of ha halfway happened. We have them for the coffee table, but we don't really have any shelf books. Yeah. Which room are we trying to decorate right now? Let's start this one. Let's yeah. just knock it out. Bottom, Love it. Let's go bottom up. Okay, I'm okay. ready. Do you want that in here as a layered Ooh. moment or like over the bean bag? What if you have oh, sheepskin over the over the sack bag or whatever? Do you what think is they'll clash with the carpet? Oh, let's talk about the carpet. <laughs> <laughs> let's sister standoffs. <laughs> I I'm not loving this carpet right now that we have underneath our feet. And the new one. The new one. That's the jute carpet. What is there to not love about it? It's I think it's too yellow. Okay, well here's my thing. Okay. It's Maybe natural. It's, it's natural white. It's, it's natural fiber. It's you wanted the layered colors, the layered tones, yes. right? As going with minimalist design, yes. you have to layer different tones to create complexity because you don't have like wham bam contrast going on. This is true. It's also been the rainiest week ever in LA history. This don't is quote true. me on that, but <laughs> it's been really dim outside so you've had the yellowy lights on it all the time. Like you literally haven't seen it in full on daylight. Yay or nay, carpet. Nay. Yay or nay. Yay. Yay or nay. Yay. Yay or nay. Yay. Woo! Oh. Yay. Uh, <laughs> I'm attacked. People do this, they buy big items, before they finish the rest of their place, they become fixated on that item. They change Smart. it out, they return it, and then they just become hung up, and three years later, they haven't decorated their room because they haven't found the right rug. Mm. Whereas, let's live with this, let's get the rest of the room pulled together, let's let the sun shine, and then call me. Okay. <laughs> I'm giving you the benefit of the doubt, because I, I trust know, you. I know, I know. It's very good. Not loving it right now. I, I, I totally feel you. It's a good life lesson. 
But I feel like this is an important thing to show in the video because like in the design process, not everything always goes perfectly. No. Like there are always things that go wrong. Sometimes you pick things and then they look good online and they don't come the same way. Mm -hmm. Me before and after face two and on Instagram. <laughs> um, and it's just like sometimes you need to switch it up or wait until the end and see what it looks like. I feel like that should be in here. Once we move the folding table. This is the room where you most readily want your throw blankets available, yes, right? Definitely. And we've got so many great options. We've got like this kind of one. That's a good one. This, one's, one. this one's good for like, look, don't cuddle. Yeah, right? that one's going to cuddle underneath that. This one will be the one that's permanently on this ladder. Okay. The rest of them will be Useful. rotating. I feel like we should put this marble chain underneath the TV. Yeah, I'm trying to clean. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm cleaning well. No, no, no. What we need is we need a box for it to like drape on so you see the movement of it. Exactly. Great. Beautiful. Two of our four books <laughs> already styled. <laughs> Do you think it's too much marble options? Yeah, we need some other color pops to offset. So maybe layer it with like this guy. Props to this. I mean, that's <laughs> cute there, but now. <laughs> that's true. Did you just take those out of my centerpiece? Yeah, I did, but it's so full. <laughs> true. Okay, okay, James, here's here's options plant. Yes. Or sculpture. Good. Right? Because we'll have a lot of plants going on in the shelves. We're not on that room right now. Joey! <laughs> Come back! Mmm, that mirror looks not good there. No? Yeah, it does. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, looks nice. Maybe get something at the end hmm. to really <laughs> encompass it all. What about this little dripper? Oh, I love yeah, a dripper. I love a little dripper. Like, if we have a little dripper coming. Playing with the mm, yes. like, let's the, let this not be so perfect. Straight, perfect. No, you have to put it on the shelf, James, <laughs> to make it look like you water it. Because you can't water up there. Yeah. No one will believe it's real. That's yeah. a good tip. Uh huh. Oh, oh I would, I would never think that deep about it. <laughs> well, you probably should quit your job. Now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> James, what do you what do you think about like a a frame, resting frame moment. I love a good resting frame moment. Okay. Do you want him still in, over there? Because obviously he's been living over there. Do you want to change him up? Let's switch him up. Yeah. I think we need something actually tall here though, to balance out because it's like well, tall, short, short, tall. What was wrong with that? Mm. Too tall. Kind of ugly. It looks not ugly, but like I feel like it doesn't, doesn't fit. Yeah. Oh, you probably need a decorative ball. Decorative ball. Did you try the ball? I was thinking about it. Try it. Oh, that looks nice. It's actually kind of good. Very curvy. I think it's good, and I also kind of love the bookend, the subtle bookend of like the silver sculpture, silver sculpture. It's like this is I like, like a magnified version of that. Yeah. Okay, I'm taking price tags off because we love this. The animal, the money, money, money. Unless it's coffee, 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 table books. <laughs> Oh wow, okay, you are getting brave tonight. That was true though. Yeah. <laughs> Look how chic that is. Two boxes for the price of one. Whoa, 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 you're gonna use all four of the remaining books? All four. <laughs> wow. wow. That actually looks good. It looks good, but we don't have any more for any of the other shelves now. Oh wow, this is the main room. I think we need a candle moment. We need a candle oh, moment. Oh, That looks so good. That's a nice aged mercury glass bitten bomb. <laughs> I mean, it's not so good. I found that at Target. I was like, I think we'll be purchasing this right now. Since we don't have the big beefy black tray, maybe we use the mirror tray here. Or do you like it? I don't so like floating. I well, I feel like the, those two bases are the same height, so that needs to change. This is so hard. I'm going home. <laughs> I think you should take away the, the lantern and the white vase and just leave the cool vase and the plants. No. No. <laughs> just take the watering can away. No, no, the watering can is the best piece. No, the watering can should be on the shelf. No, okay, we need fine. This. We need a good pot to put this in. Why? It's in a pot. It kind of looks cheap in that pot. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Some little stubs. <laughs> I think that could go up, up. Yeah, up, up, up. Yeah. Up and away. Joey, can you do it? Mm hmm That's a nice bulbous pot. Yes, that is good. Wait, give me this small one. Joey, give me this small one. No, yeah, that, that pot right is here. thick. It's got a thick booty on it. That's good. Yeah, we like that there. What about all the way at the top for safes? With the light shining on it for glass? So it really forms a rainbow when the light hits it. Yeah. Ooh, let's yeah. try that. We're gonna get a little to put that up there. Here, I'll just throw it. <laughs> <laughs> 
But well, guess what? We get to do it all over again. Here's your accessory table. Oh my God, I it, back up. <laughs> it does look like that a lot now. Wow, you should leave that all there. That looks so good. <laughs> Why did we set this up down here when we got to go upstairs? Joey, always look at that. That's what I was wondering. When do you think I always look at the negative? Is this stupid? Should we repo all this stuff upstairs? Yeah. yeah. All right, here we go. We get to do it again. Every place you put the accessories, it looks good. Looks like a store. Okay. Get excited. <laughs> can I go to the desk area and then you guys can do like the other ones? Sure. Okay. So just this is all we got to do and we're done. Yay! That's big. Do you want the globe for the top of the... The piano? Or no. you want it here? Do you I don't want think you want on the piano. Oh, no. I want sister candles. Yeah, candles. Yeah. No idea. Wow, that's Tom Ford book is so very chic. And it's the chicest of cheeks. Oh, yeah, there. Oh, yes. Bam. I don't think you need anything else on the piano. No, I agree. Maybe just play by that little side thing. Just a floor, a floor sitter. A floor sitter option. I think we should put the table over here and put the wire sculpture maybe here. Uh. Or switch it. When you walk up the stairs and see the wire sculpture, it's amazing. But that mirrors for own TVs. Yeah, that's true. So you want it in the pics. Yeah, well, it's going to be better than that table for your pictures. Does that fit up here? So are we good? I think we're good. And moral of the story is we got enough stuff. Yeah, we did. Could have done with the coffee table booger too, but. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Did we do it? Are we done? I think we're done. I think we're done. I can't believe it. Sister. <laughs> Sister. <laughs> is it sleepy time? Yeah. Oh my God, we're such sleepy days. sisters. It's been four days. We've four had days. literally the time of our life, and we just finished literally the most beautiful house in the entire world. I agree. Yes. Ah, Daddy Joey. <laughs> Should we head to the beauty studio to say goodbye? Yes. Although I never want to say goodbye. That's so true. But I'm so glad that it's done. Okay, so let's do it. Let's go. Right. <laughs> oh my god, you guys. We are done. done. Well, I really am going to miss you. I'm so... I mean, I was already obsessed with you, but now I'm attached Sister, to you. Sister, I feel like literally like this collab has been in the works for so long now. <laughs> and I've been subscribed to you guys for so long. And this just meant so much to me that you wanted to come over and work together on this project too, which was so cool. I know that that's something very different for you guys, but I feel like it turned out so good. And... I'm just very, very proud of what we did, and thank you guys for being the best ever, and for being talented, and for helping me out. We're, oh God, we're so you, impressed by you. Yeah. Like, you've done so much in such a short amount of time. Oh, thank you guys. We talk about you all the time. I just, like, love watching your growth, and I'm just so proud of you, and really just truly so happy for you, and so excited to always see what you're doing. You guys so, are our no. so Thank you guys so much. You guys are literally the rest of the entire world. I hope all you sisters enjoyed this little decorating video. Obviously, we are done, but you guys have not yet seen the finished product. My final house tour that I've been promising you guys forever <laughs> is coming. This upcoming Friday, the house is done, so I literally have no excuses now. So stay tuned this Friday, and I hope you guys enjoyed this little decorating video and got lots of tips from Kate and Joey and I. This was so much fun to do, and I know you guys are going to love the finished product. I know that I do, and if you did enjoy it, please don't forget to give a big thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you have not already. Come join the sisterhood. We are 13 million sisters trying to love to have you join the family. Click the bell icon so you can get a notification every time I upload a brand new video. Also, like we talk about, the front living room was very much covered because over on Kate and Joey's channel, we, we did have, it. We did it. <laughs> we took it from empty to full. We surprised you with the design. It was the only part of it, obviously, that James didn't have his digits in. We were like fully surprised by it. So yeah, if you got, if you want to see James, these sister surprise. It's up right it's now. Up. Go subscribe to them. Kate and Joy have literally some of the best content on the entire YouTube platform, in my opinion. I've been subscribed to them for over four years now, and just like they said for me, following their growth has been so incredible, and I am so proud of them, and doing this collab was such a dream come true. So mm -hmm. you sisters need to go support them as well. Um, if you'd like to follow me on my makeup journey, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. They're both just James Charles. My Snapchat for more behind the scenes sites up is James Charles and then extra S after Charles. Mm -hmm. If you guys want to follow them, 
Mr. Kate. <laughs> yeah! Eee! Eee! We love you, our <laughs> baby! This video is sister shout out goes to sister Evelyn. Thank you so much love for always following and supporting. You know I love you literally so, so, so much. And if you at home look to be the next video's sister shout out, don't forget to turn on my video post notifications and also reach my video links so they go live on Twitter. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video today. We love you and we will see you in the next one. Bye! Bye.